So I thought for Christmas. Right? It is Christmas. It is Christmas. We'll pick 12 subjects mm -hmm. that we're excited about for 2018. Uh, and like we can quiz each other about them in okay. two minutes. Oh, all right. Got okay, to... my subject for the two minutes is background fetch. Oh, background fetch. Didn't we have that before? No. What was it? We had the thing that we had before. Oh, we, you're thinking of background sync, right? Background sync, service worker event that would happen uh, next time you had connectivity. Okay. And you could do sort of whatever you wanted there. Okay. It's not that. What is background fetch? Now that's that's a very open-ended question, <laughs> which you could have said. <laughs> what is the use case for background fetch? Right. So think about a long download that's going to you know maybe take videos. A video. Yeah. Good one. Okay. Right. Uh, and that could take. You know, hours, days. We don't want the browser to be <laughs> like it could take days. Remember, I mean, videos get big. Mobile data is slow. Uh, you could be offline for a while, and we don't want the the uh, the mobile to the browser to have to be awake for that whole thing. Okay, so basically, it would be outsourcing the the fetch thing to the operating system rather than yes on desktop though as well. Yes, is the plan, but it, probably mobile first. Yes, because but that, also desktop that makes more sense. Okay. So yeah. we, we ha do we have an origin trial or something? There's, so there's something in Canary now. OK, it's cool. pretty good. Uh, and it means we, we don't actually need uh, user permission to do this, because you can already start downloads without user permission. That's true. Uh, the idea is to make sure it's fully visible mm -hmm. all the time. Uh, so you can see like the progress of the download. You can give it an icon, give it a title. So the user's aware that it's happening. They can cancel it if they okay. want. OK. Like, do I, can I put like a 20 gig video into cache API now? Uh, yes. If you have persistent data, you have uh, as much space as you can eat. Right? You, need to, you need to ask for that. That does require a permission. OK. Um, that's a lot of data. That is a lot of data. But people like movies, right? And you don't want, <laughs> you don't want them disappearing just as you're Citation getting on a flight. Right? <laughs> <laughs> people do like movies. Look, there's loads of them. People, we build big buildings where we show them. Have okay. you ever seen these? So we have but, a canary. Any other browser signals? Uh, positive signals from a couple of browsers, uh, but it's just Chrome for now, and that'll be 2018. That was two minutes. That was spot on. OK. Now, what's a worklet? Worklet is like a worker, like a potentially off-thread thing. Yes. But it's more like, wait, 